Hello everybody, welcome back to How to Build a B-1 Bomber. I decided to make you guys an extra movie and uh, let you watch me make these bulkheads. Okay, I got this one cut real good. So I took my hot glue gun and I just kind of tacked it to the fuselage on my lines where I want it. Now I'm going to come over to this side. I'm going to put this camera right here. And uh, put me a new blade, my exacto nut. See, I, well, all I did was trace this onto this wood. And I know it's going to be pretty close. See, it's, this ain't right, so I'll come in here and, and go a little bits at a time. Don't want to go too much. I'm gonna get to this trim. That's it. Just took some CA and glued it back together where it snapped off. That's no big deal. Go some more just at the very top. And when you get going like that, you gotta come back from the other way. Kind of go back and forth on the grain. Be careful not to split it. And here on this mark a little bit. A little bit right there. Just kind of whittle on it because you know what? The inside is going to look just like this side. But, um, just kind of see where I'm going with that. Get a new exacto blade, man, it, it goes good. A little bit more up in this corner, up in the top. But nice, it just needs to come down, and it's going to come down by whittling right there. close enough where I can just start, I can use sandpaper. Where'd my sandpaper go? Here we go. Now I like to, when I want to sand something like this, I'll use this rough 36 grit. Because you know, if you take a fine grip paper, it tends to want to follow the contours where your rough paper will straighten it out. Just kind of be careful. And don't take too much at once. good. That looks good people. Now I'll take my hot glue gun and I'll glue these two pieces together and then tack glue it down here. Then I can take another piece of ball so you can see and just glue it right there. And all along just put little tacks. And I'll go completely around. The bottom will be easy. It's just got one little curve where the, you know, kind of the shape of the nacelle on the bottom. The rest is flat. But I can just take and glue some little pieces on the bottom. And then, uh, I'll have the, I'll have my bulkhead. 
then I'll just come in here and, and cut it somewhere pull it off glue it back together and uh, I'll have my bulkhead and uh, it, it's really not that hard and uh, you guys can do it too I know you can and we've had some questions how are you gonna make them bulkheads you know and I wasn't worried about it but uh, that's how I'm going to do it. As soon as this sets up, I'm going to go ahead and get that one done. And uh, this is the one for the front. Remember I made this a long time ago? And then actually what I'm going to do is I'll save these, these first three, and they'll be my patterns. And then I'll cut them out on my routing table. Just screw two pieces of this on that piece of wood right over there and go around it with, on my routing table cuts me out another perfect bulkhead and that way I'll always have my masters and uh, it's that easy so I hope you guys enjoyed this little flurry, flurry of videos and I'm going to get a shout out to everybody watching and uh, hey I got a I got a, a message from this old boy down in New Zealand he says they, they rock down there too they love their airplane so let's get a shout out to them boys in New Zealand and and i uh, got people in Europe watching. What's up, fellas? And uh, down there, it's in the southern hemisphere, down there in Brazil. And, and uh, let's just get a big shout out to everybody. And uh, glad you watched these videos. And just keep watching. We're going to get this thing in the air. And, uh, and so we're on a mission now. I'm going to make that next deadline in May. And uh, we're going to go. So, hey, I hope you guys watched that movie of uh, that airplane Butch put up. It's under uh, B-58 Hustler, I believe. And uh, he's supposed to put a link on one of these movies. Uh, that plane's got a P-200 in it. And uh, watch that thing roll, man. That's one of Tom Cook's planes with a P-200. Whoo! I've yet to watch it. I'm going to do that as soon as I'm done with this video. Talk to y'all later. We'll see you in the shop.